Well, it's time for another Breeders' Cup sprint now. This is the third Breeders' Cup sprint by my reckoning. I think we've got a turf, we've got a fillies and mares, and now we've got a dirt. And we've only just about managed double figures in two of them. Ten in this one, I think ten in the one earlier today. And Alan, uh, let's start that again. Ali Alejandro for Padrego. Got the top unbeaten Desert Valentine, John Morgan. Green Cape, Darren Thompson. I'm your son, Derek Hinton. Meridian Prime, Vinnie Gerard. Free thinker, Leon Van Rensburg. Is it because I'm here? Joshua Sutherland, Minkover, Gallery, Rod McClure. Flying the flag for the smaller trainers. Pushin, Marion, Vinnie Gerard and Nifty for John Morgan. Away they go then. And Nifty was nicely out, so too was Stablemate Desert Valentine, the unbeaten horse over on the far side. I am your son in the Derek Hinton Pink, but there's about six of them queuing up for the lead at the moment. Nothing has gone on and taken the race by the scruff of the neck at all. Minkova Gallery is the one that's widest on the track and is giving away the most ground. <laughs> Just bet, wouldn't you, that it would be the lowest graded trainer that got the worst run. But it's I Am Your Son who's got the lead on the inside from a free thinker and Desert Valentine. Is it because I'm here in Nifty? Oh, next, the three are out the back. Oh, Meridian Prime, Green Cape and Pusha Marion, but they can all finish with a rattle as they pass them. Well, they're well past the midway point because they're coming down towards the two furlong pole now. And it's free thinker. And is it because I'm here with Nifty and Desert Valentine and trying to preserve that unbeaten record? The four of them are in a line. Bin Cover Gallery's running a big race up the outside, but it's just as it because I'm here in the lead from Desert Valentine. Nifty, I am your son, is still trying to battle on as well, but it's just now Desert Valentine who bursts into the lead. And Desert Valentine's going to maintain the unbeaten record and take it comfortably. Desert Valentine wins it easily. From is it because I'm here in Nifty once again? The Vinnie Gerard horse is finishing with a wet sail at the end, but left their runners a little bit too late. As they have put in earlier races as well. Desert Valentine, and there's a definite possibility that Mr. John Morgan is going to take the title this season with a week to go. I think he might be just about in the lead now. I've really been counting. I've been too busy commentating to count. But it's Desert Valentine for John Morgan, the winner. Is it because I'm here, Joshua Sutherland, second? Nifty for John Morgan, third. Meridian Prime and Pusher Murray for Vinnie Gerard, fourth and fifth. Now, the reason I mention that is because John Morgan has got such a small stable and doesn't race his horses every week. If he'd been racing every week, he'd be further in front on the flat than Joshua Sutherland is on the jumps. So, let's see what happens for the rest of the season.